In by Clichy. Silva, Zavaleta, Silva, Dzeko, Mackie, taken back by Clichy, 89 minutes up, Balotelli! It's a corner, last off Anuaha, the young man who is about to deny the team of his boyhood, the team of his dreams, the title. Clichy, Nasri. Another corner. Corner's no good now. They have to turn into goals. A time of prayer. Skulls header back. Three minutes additional time confirmed here. Five minutes at the Etihad. And just to confirm that Queen's Park Rangers reduced to 10 men, lead 2-1 at Manchester City. In by Nasri. Manchester City will get their 17th corner here. Queen's Park Rangers have had none. Just the most staggering football match this in almost any circumstances, but played in the context it is. It defies all sense. Balotelli, great save! Well, he should score from there, but Kenny's been inspired today. And Kenny comes and Kenny claims. What a day to be a supporter of Queen's Park Rangers. What a day to be a supporter of Manchester City. Where will they hide tonight? Where will they go? Where will they find the moral fibre to get up and go to work in the morning? De Jong. Silva. If they score now, there just might be time. Zavaleta, corner again, they're 80. Staggering, just staggering. Silva, Checo scores! Four minutes to save themselves! Four minutes to find that crown! 2-2! Two -two. In stoppage time, the most thrilling Premier League finale of all time. Eddie Dzeko, hope, a vestige of hope. Well, I talked from the very first minute of this game about when City got it wide without Balotelli and Dzeko. They just didn't have that physical presence to trouble Ferdinand and Hill. But, great ball in, great leap from Dzeko and hope, hope for Mancini. Well, there is a goal to report at Manchester City. It's 2-2. It is 2-2. And that would take City to 87 points. Manchester United are on 89 if they close out this win. Just unbelievable. There's never been a final day like this. It can't, can it? It can't. It could, oh. Manchester City could go and score here and win the league with just about the last pick of the season. What a product this is. Clichy. Remember, Bolton are just drawing at Stoke. QPR could be safe anyway. This is all about the title now. Two and a half minutes of stoppage time played. Two and a half minutes to play. Away by Hill. Zavaleta. Out comes Wright Phillips, he must run for the hills. It's a QPR throw. Nasri, he thought, Nasri thought he was getting the, shot, the, the throw there, he could have kept that in. Howard Webb blows the final whistle. And it means that Manchester United have done their job here.
and now face a wait, an anxious wait of maybe two minutes before they know whether they are champions again. Wayne Rooney's goal has decided this contest. Why do you love the game? This is why you love the game. Absolutely phenomenal. And there are two minutes to play. Manchester United's game is over. So is Bolton's game at Stoke. QPR are safe, they don't know it yet. Balotelli. Aguero! Staggering! Just staggering! He's won the lead with 90 seconds of stoppage time to play. United's game was over. They had it. They've had it stolen back. It's just the most extraordinary scenario you could have dreamt of. Where does football go from here? But Manchester City are still playing in their home city and are drawing 2-2, but no! Alec Ferguson can't believe it, Manchester City have scored again! And lead by three goals to two. And that may be the final twist of all. Sergio Aguero has scored for Manchester City and Manchester United cannot believe it. Drama of the ultimate type. Tears of distress turn to tears of unbridled joy. Well, I, I've got to say, Peter, I don't think I've ever witnessed emotions like I've seen today from crowd to the field, to the lead, to being behind, to the clock running out. To Paddy Kenny making save after save and what he could have gone down there, Sergio Aguero. And arguably he's been their most consistent player this season. He stays on his feet and boy does he get his rewards. The title is heading to the Etihad. We are in the 95th minute of the last game of the season. And the Barclays Premier League has produced here the ultimate in sporting drama. It just does not get better than this. It will never get better than this in blue. And I'm just looking down at Mark Hughes and uh, the QPR coaches. I presume they know that they're safe. I presume word has reached them. I hope it has. I hope it has. There is going to be here universal celebration. QPR are safe and they know it. Manchester City are seconds away from being the champions. The blue moon has risen. Just like a dream in their City are champions, and they did it in the most staggering fashion.